Right. This calls for a celebration. There we go. So, to trip up north. We got there in the end. Let's hope the end justifies the means. Oh. Hey, you open up, or what? You ready? As I'll ever be. Ah, congratulations, your first customer. Ah, oh, nice one. Why don't you sit yourself down here, mate? Tell me exactly what you're after. Ah, uh, well, I'll, um, I'll have my shave and haircut for a quid, huh? What? <laughs> no, no, it, it's a tenner. It's not a quid. What? A charity case. Really? Wait, right, well... Looks like someone needs to go to Specsavers then, doesn't it? Well, I don't believe this. Did you not check these before you dished them out? Oh, I can't blame it on me. He designed it then. Oh, well, let's hope your eyesight's better when it comes to cutting hair. Huh. i tell you what, you think yours is so much better? You cut yourself. What are you doing? I'm going to work somewhere my talents are appreciated. OK, good luck. But I cannot need it. Oh, come on, don't be like that. All right, boys, make this uh, special offer. Mm, okay. If I'd been in the army, would name this place after me. Shaving Private Ryan. <laughs> How many of them have you had? Four. Oh, Nick, this is getting stupid now. I'm gonna have to start oh. turning people away soon. Sit down, lads. Uh, what are we gonna do when the Gazette get here? Well, when are they getting here? Well, soon Thomas just takes it, his trainers run over. You gonna leave us sat here all day, mate? Nah, I'm coming now. Right, Ryan, that's you done, mate. Already? Yeah. You've already taken anything off. What would you expect for a quid? Okay, things are a bit complicated. You're going to have to go to the meeting on your own. But I told you, there's something I need to discuss with you first. Right, let's someone take over here. There's nothing I can do. Ow! Watch yourself, will you? What? Oh, you just cut me? No, I haven't. So what do you call this? <laughs> Hello, I'm really sorry. Obviously, it goes without saying you won't be charged. I was only paying a quid in the first place. Hey, listen, mate. He's a doctor, so you can take a look at it for you. Yeah, all right, give me a minute. You're all right. Reckon I'll just take a photo, preserve the crime scene. You know what, mate? If it is that bad, right, we just have a little look. What do you think you're doing? Trying to make this worry? There's something weird about us. Why won't you let us see? Only thing weird is how you got to be a barber. Do you know what? I think you're lying. Just let me have a look. I'm not warning you! Touch me again, and I'm calling the police. Dick? Hey, <laughs> Tommy. Uh, Tommy, good to see you. Why don't we, uh, why don't we just go through here, yeah? Oh, look, oh, sorry about the mix-up, Tommy. Um, how about I get you a craft beer or something? Uh, no, I can't. I'm training. OK, uh, coffee? We grind it on the premises, you know, responsibly sourced and everything. Yeah. You want the real story, love? Take a picture of this. Sweeney Toddy and then sliced through me jugular. What? What's he talking about? Nothing. Ignore him. He's made the whole thing up. If he asked me, he's on something. Yeah, I suppose I made this up and all. Do you, do you mind? I mean, get that thing out of my face. I'm epileptic, okay, you know that. Why don't we just sort this out outside, you know, amicably? Yeah, that? Now they're trying to buy me off. Well, if you think I'm going quietly, you're wrong. Five minutes from now, this is going viral. Give me a minute. Come on, we can work this out. Hello, Nick. Of course. You work for her, don't you? And David didn't cut your neck at all, did he? Amazing what you can do with a bit of fake blood. You should have listened when I warned you. Oh, and in case you're wondering, it was me who told Andrea to tweet the flyers. Of course. I'd expect nothing less. She starts back with me tomorrow, by which time I reckon you'll be out of business. Do you know what I'm fascinated? Are you really that threatened by our tiny little barbers? Someone's changed their tune. Yesterday you were the big I am, going to take over the world. How the mighty have fallen. You gonna tell me who that was? And what the hell she was talking to you about? <laughs>